we get the scroll home, the sooner we deal with my father. Well, that was an experience. What do you mean by home? Are you talking about Fort Dawnguard? You're calling that home? Oh boy, okay. Uh, so... Yeah. What is this that I have? Oh, nothing. Okay. Alright, how do we get out of here? Uh, no, thank you. So I think from this point we can return to the Soul Cairn whenever we want. We just have to come back here and go through that portal again. I'll probably never do that though because there's nothing else for me there. Am I going the right way? I don't feel like I am. Uh, oh, I'm lost. Let's see, if I go this way. Oh, yeah, that's the wrong way. Oh, Volkahar Balcony. I can probably leave through there. Because all you need in order to be able to fast travel is to be outside most of the time. Sometimes even when you are outside, you're unable to, but... Ah. Okay. Should be able to fast travel from here. Even if I can't, I can. I could jump off. So let's see. To the... Fort. Yes. Ah. So long since I'd seen sunlight. All right, I'm assuming they're up there. Let's see. Um, okay, they're not there. And they're... N Ugh, are they downstairs? For goodness sake. Oh yeah, they are here. Goodness. What's he doing in here? <laughs> I trust your journey was successful? Uh, yeah. I'm sorry, my friend. I can no longer be of use in this matter. Why? It's my fault. In my haste to read the first scroll, I neglected the careful preparation required. I thought I'd be able to allay the after effects, but I was wrong. Now I am paying for it. Um. Blind? Yes, I'm afraid so. No, it will have to run its course. And there's always the chance I may never recover. Well, I guess that's it then. No, there is another way. The question is, how much are you willing to risk to find Oriole's bow? Uh, it depends. I can't guarantee you'd be free from harm. Becoming blind could be the least of your worries. Scattered across Tamriel are secluded locations known only as Ancestor Glades. There's one in Skyrim in the Pine Forest. Performing the ritual of the Ancestor Moth within the Glade should provide the answers you seek. Right. It involves carefully removing the bark from a canticle tree, which will in turn attract Ancestor Moths to you. Once enough of the Moths are following, they'll provide you with the second sight needed to decipher the scrolls. Second sight? In keeping with tradition, you must use a specific tool in the Ancestor Glade, an implement known as a draw knife. Every moth priest is taught this ritual, but few ever get the chance to perform it. You should consider yourself fortunate if it works for you. Okay. From what I saw in the vision, the Elder Scroll which foreshadows the defiance of the gods with the blood of mortals is the key to the prophecy. 
So... What do moths have to do with it? Well, as I'm sure you figured out by now, it's no mere coincidence that we're named Moth Priests. The voice of the ancestor moth has always been an integral part of reading the Elder Scrolls. Right. Oh, the moths don't literally read the scrolls, but they maintain a connection to ancient magic that allows the moth priests to decipher them. If you listen closely when you find the glade, you should be able to hear their song, a soft, harmonious trilling. It's through this ancestral chorus that the moths tap into a form of primal augur and become a conduit for deciphering the scrolls. Uh, okay. By having the ancestor moths close to the moth priest, they can utilize the conduit and share the moth's augury. Only the most resilient of priests can do it this way. It takes years of practice to interpret the harmony. Hmm. You've come this far, and you've found several Elder Scrolls. Whether you believe it or not, the scrolls have a mind of their own. If they did not want you to find them, they would not allow it. Because of this, I strongly believe you were meant to hear the ancestral chorus. Only one way to find out. Only one way, indeed. So, what specifically do we need to do? Find a knife. Okay. Next fight bring your victory, friend. Thanks, dog. Alright, where can I find this knife? I don't even see the quest marker on the map. Uh do I have the quest activated? Yeah. Am I blind? It's on the compass, but it's not on the map. Why is that? Who's this? I've never seen these people before. Maybe it just wants me to go out the long way. <sighs> I presume once we get to the outside of the cave, the uh, quest marker will update. I think, I hope. We'll see. I'm glad I don't... Oh, who's this? Oh my. <laughs> Serana's spells have like no effect. Was that a Falmer arrow I just shot? Uh, it was. I have like no arrows anymore. I have a fair amount of these I guess I can use. Okay. What was I saying? Oh my, there's more? Wait. Oh no, it's not the same one. I thought uh, the body di of the other one disappeared. Serana, come on now. Oh my. <laughs> Serana, you are useless. Hopefully that's all of them. Oh man, that just like destroyed my train of thought. Whoa. Those trees up there are being funky. Ah. <sighs> 
It's nice walking outside after spending so long in that horrible place. Okay, so now will it tell me? Oh my gosh, are you kidding me? Oh my. Easy. Where's she even at? Oh. Who's this? Argonian. Um. I, I, I'm very confused. Why are they fighting each other? Uh, I didn't think that. Now you're dead. And whoever this guy is is dead as well. Good lord. Oh my gosh. Okay. Where am I supposed to go? Aha! Was this on the map before? I don't think it was. Maybe it was and I'm just dumb. I'll have to go back and watch. So there should be a road that leads to it. Yeah, it's up ahead. And there's also a bear. There we go. And I hear a dragon, but I don't think he'll visit us. Time will tell. Mm, he sounds close, actually. What's this? Bandits. Easy now. Oh my, back off. Gosh. I'm not killing people as easily because I haven't been sneaking around. But I mean, I'm not just gonna walk around outside like this. I wouldn't, it would take forever to get anywhere. Okay. Have I been here before? This r path looks very familiar. I don't know why. Oh, yeah, okay. That dragon won't bother us. Because he's part of, uh... A location over there. Dragons that are tied to specific locations normally don't deviate too far from them. So we should be good. He's making quite a racket though. Oh my... This reminds me of when, well actually it doesn't, because it wasn't snowy. I was going to say, what, is this the top? Oh, okay. I was going to say that it reminded me of hiking up to, what was it, Nevada Falls in uh, Yosemite. Oh, I hear a dragon. What, I thought this was the entrance to the cave. Oh no, it's right here. But yeah, it was somewhat similar to that winding, rocky uh, pathways. That was literally a. Not very impressive, is it? Well, it's not bad. Instead I mean. Of being a wasted trip, your friend Dexian and I are gonna have some words when we get back. Okay. Uh, but anyway, uh, that that was a six-hour hike up, and I think it took like mm, three to go down we made good time going down because 
We were so tired, we were ready to get back. We ran out of water. Okay, I ran out of water. And I refused to take any from him because... Well... I don't know. When you accept help, you admit defeat. Whoa. Wow. Look at this place. No one's been here in centuries. How can you tell? I doubt there's any other place like it in Skyrim. It's beautiful. So I ran out of water. I didn't I refused to take any of his. I got to be starving. Um and he gave me this like granola thing and as soon as I put it in, into my mouth it turned into sand and I just like Oh gosh, that was bad. We got to the top though, it was fun. Ah, so is this my knife? Well, we got the knife. Now all we need to do is track down one of those canticle trees. Well, luckily, they're all over the place. Hope the moths like that bark as much as Dexian said they would. Attract swarms like this. Look at them. They've definitely taken a liking to you. Oh, nice. Yeah, okay. Things, you're starting to glimmer. Excuse me? Glimmer. What's this what's this light here? Oh look, there's more over there. Hey, come follow me. Oh, look, there's another one. And another. Oh, yeah, I like my mothy friends. Oh, whoa. Is that what she means by glimmer? Oh, I got another one. Let's see. And another one. Oh my gosh, this is freaky. Seven out of seven. Whoa. I think that might have been what we were waiting for. What? Let's head back up there and see if we can read the scrolls. I have to go all the way back down. <sighs> these moths. I'd rather be moths than bees, though, that's for sure. Bees aren't even that bad. Uh, wasps are terrible. Yellow jackets. One time yellow jackets stopped me from eating a burrito. Ugh, they're the worst. Okay, so. I need to read the scroll. This one. Um, how many times do I need to read it? Looks like a map. What is it a map of, though? I don't recognize it. Are you okay? Almost thought I lost you there. You went as white as the snow. Um. What uh? What happened? I could see it in your eyes. You looked about a thousand leagues away. What about Ariel's bow? Do you know where we can find it? Uh, apparently it's in Darkfall Cave. Then it's almost over. We can finally put an end to this ridiculous prophecy. Where is this Darkfall Cave? Couldn't tell you. Oh, actually I could. <laughs> then let's get going. I want to get there before my father has a chance to track us down. Okay, well let's go. Ooh. 
locate the bow. So we shall. Oh, freaking gargoyles. Easy, buddy. Oh, I'm about to die. I don't think I need potions, though. I think I got this. Oh my, there's a lot of bad people here. Okay, he's dead. He's dead. And... Oh, nice shot. Sweet! Alright. Let's get the heck out of here. Watch there be more. They just kill me in one shot. Oh, I'd be so salty. It doesn't look like that's the case though, thankfully. Alright, where's this cave? All the way over here. Um, if we went from here, we could go like down across that way, maybe. It's worth a try. <sighs> Alright. There should be a path coming off of this path going to the south. Could it be this here? Yes, it is. Okay. Cool. Oh, look at this wide open field. I like this. If this was Minecraft, I would build my house here. Uh, which way do I need to be going? I'm already lost. This way? Yeah. Up this way. Okay. Interesting. What is this? Volskig. Volskig. I don't know how to say that. That's my best guess. Let's see. We're kind of going the right way. I need to take a right ish who oh my okay Who's there? who is there who is that looks like a guard who is that oh forsworn I didn't think we were in the reach I figured this would be um Hafingar. Hafingar? I don't know how to say it. Whatever hold Solitude is the capital of. That's where I figured we were. Because, I mean... Yeah, I thought all of this was Hafingar. I mean, I thought the Reach was like this. And then this was Hjalmarch. The Pale, Winter Hold. East March is like this, I think. The Rift is like this. Falkreath is like this. White Run's like this. Is that all of them? I don't know, I wasn't counting. There's an Orc Stronghold up ahead. Oh, 
Oh man. It's quite a nice night actually. Oh, I kind of have a headache coming on. That's not good. What do we have here? More Kazgur. Kazgur. More Kazgur. Gur? Kazgur. I don't know. I'm already lost. Am I still on the road? Uh, well, I don't need to be. Oh, bear. Multiple bears. Oh, that ain't a bear. That is not a bear at all. Who's there? But they're both dead, so that's good. Oh, I don't have a level up. I thought I did. I wasn't about to use it. I was just checking. Alright, we're getting close to this cave, I think. I'm not sure which way to go in order to get to it. Let's see, I'll try it this way. See how that does for us. Um. Aha. Okay, well. In we go, I guess.